Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl, Christian Ture. This will be the start of my weekly vlog. Please don't mind my appearance. I actually just woke up and decided, let me make this my first video. But yes, this will be the start of my weekly vlogs. Today is Thursday, which is basically the end of the week. But I didn't have anything to do earlier this week. I just moved in, which I would have recorded, but y'all, it is so hot in Tallahassee. I didn't even know where my phone was half of the time. So me trying to vlog it, I don't know. I think I'm gonna just give you guys a room tour, let you know like everything that I got is from because I'm actually from Orlando and that's where I went my, my shopping. I got my stuff from. Not too much from here in Tallahassee because to me Tallahassee is an old town. The mall sucks. Like how does your mall suck? So I think I'm gonna give you guys a room tour maybe next week. I'm not sure because classes start next week actually. And I'm going to be on campus some of the time. So with my weekly vlog, basically, I'm just let y'all know what my channel is about. It's basically going to be about, um, well, I'm definitely going to do weekly vlogs, like I said before. But it's going to be based around, like, college, vacation, and what I do on a regular basis. I've been wanting to start this channel for about a few years now. I'm not sure why I haven't picked up the camera or my phone. I'm just starting with my phone. I'm not sure I haven't picked up the phone yet and started, but today I'm starting. So today is going to be, like I said, the start of my vlog. Today I'm going to get my lashes done and I'm not sure what else I'm going to do. But tomorrow I have a nail appointment to get my nails and toes did. And then Saturday I'm going to this Black Girl Business Summit that family's hosting. So I'm going to see how that goes because I do have a business and I want to learn like more about how to run a business so yeah we're gonna get started hey y'all so i just made it to my last appointment it is currently 11 51. my appointment was originally for 12 not 12 originally for 11 but she asked to push it back for 12 which wasn't bad i just walked around target i didn't pull out my phone because i was just lollygagging in there it wasn't really nothing to look at i was just trying to you know let time pass by but i found this girl on instagram and I really hope she does good. Her pictures are really nice. I'm gonna tag her Instagram page down below. And I hope I'm hoping for a classic set, not not so more not how you say it, not really like a dramatic set because I really don't go nowhere and I'm really a natural person. Like I don't wear makeup at all. The most you'll see me have on are lashes, lip gloss. Y'all see I don't have no eyebrows. I really want my eyebrows tinted, but that's another bill for a different day. I'ma just keep on drawing them in the best I can. I barely can draw them all, but I be trying just a little something. So yeah, I'm gonna go in now because it's left. Hey guys, so I made it back home from my last appointment. Afterwards, I just went and got something to eat and came back home. I really don't have too much planned for the rest of the day, but for my last appointment, it went really well. I really love my lashes. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but like I said, I did get the classic set because I didn't want anything too dramatic or anything like that. She did really well. She's located in a shop and not in her home, which I like. I really don't like going to people's house to get my services done anyway. But yeah, I'm going to put her Instagram page down in my description. If you guys are located in Tallahassee also and want to hit her up and get an appointment, tell her I sent you. Hey you guys, today is Saturday and today I am on the way to my um, school's campus. They're having this summit, like it's called, I think, Black Girl Business Summit, something like that. It's basically a panel of black ladies who own businesses. They're going to be teaching us business tips, how to fund our business, how to make it grow, and all those type of things. I'm actually going to link my business account in my description down below. My business was um, custom clothing line, but I switched it to uh, um, a skincare line because I think that'll just be better. And it's more, it's not as expensive as having a clothing line. So I think I'm gonna do that. They're gonna be handmade products, body butters, body scrubs, body wash, those type of things. So I'm going here today to get a few tips. And um, they were having a, a draft for money. They were giving away money to help um, college students, black college students start their business, but being that I found the event so last minute, I wasn't able to enter the contest because I think you had to write like um, an essay, a five page essay, make a video and all kind of stuff, but it was too late for me to join. So I'm just gonna go to the summit, 
write down some um, tips and notes and stuff. And yeah, and I'm gonna take you guys inside with me. Y'all, tell me why I've been sitting here for an hour. Mind y'all, I transferred to this school in um, January, but in January, everything was virtual, so I didn't have to come up to the campus for anything. So I don't really know what everything is except for the um, um, the bookstore and the place to get like your um, school school card thing. So on the flyer, it, it says like a ballroom. Mind you, I don't know where nothing is, so I'm just walking around the campus. I followed the address. But the buildings don't like necessarily say like grand ballroom or like wherever the place said on the flyer. So I, I emailed the lady that even told me about the event. She's not even here. The event started at 9. It's 9.51. She's talking about, I'm sorry, I'm on my way. I'm not even there. Let me contact somebody to see what's going on. I went to the ballroom and the freaking doors are locked. There's nobody in there. It's completely dark in there. So... I'm just waiting for her to respond back to me because I really wanted to go to this summit and hear what these people got to say. I went on, um, I checked my email again and they say you can watch it from home. But when I click the link to watch it from home, it don't even work. So I don't know what to do. I've been seeing, I think I'm going to see it for another 15, 20 minutes. And if not, I'm going to just go home and count it as a loss because I'm not going to waste my Saturday sitting up at this school because I don't see nobody else around. Like there's nobody out here. Only group of people I've seen was SGA, and they don't even know what I'm talking about because I asked them where the building was located, and they was like, oh, well, it's right here next door, but I'm like, ain't nobody in there. The doors are locked, and it's completely dark, so I'm confused. I'm going to just wait 10, 15 more minutes, or did I say 15, 20 minutes? I don't know. I'm going to just wait till the lady email me back. Not email me, but I'm going to wait till the lady text me back and see what I'm supposed to do. I don't know. <laughs> as soon as I put the camera down the lady she emailed me why do I keep saying email she texted me back on group me because that's where I've been texting her at tell me why the people didn't even update the um the event on iRattler which is where they not I think it's iStrike yeah I don't even know the um the websites like that and what they use for them. but they didn't update it and now the event started at 12 o'clock and it's currently only 10 o'clock so I don't live far, so I'm just going to go home and finish doing my business cards for my new business because I need to try to get try and order those by um, next week because here at FAMU, they have set Fridays like where everybody come out and like it's like a day party, honestly. And I need to be passing out business cards because with me doing body butters and stuff and it gets it don't get cold, cold, but it gets pretty chilly up here body butters like they keep your skin moisturized and not dry you know cracking and all that so i need to be getting my business out there while i can before fall comes and i think by september i'm gonna start mixing up my formulas so i can at least if i don't ha if i'm not selling the full jars like i want to yet i can at least pass out samples so they can see so like i can give them a business card and a sample at the same time so they can know like what i'm at like how you say it? like what I have coming out so yeah I'm just gonna go home I'm gonna come back up here because I really wanted to come to this event so I'm gonna come back up here oh and I did get my nails done yesterday I just forgot to pick up the camera but this is what they look like they're like nude with the blue and white type of like what's it called abstract art is that what it's called yeah abstract art I usually get my nails like this like crazy colors whatever i'm gonna um link her instagram that did my nails her name is erica also located in tallahassee of course i'm gonna link her instagram also in my description and you guys should go ahead and follow her and book her if you're in tallahassee also so yeah see you guys later so this clip is just showing you guys like what they were so-called setting up mind you when i got there i was already early so no one was there at the time but other than that, there was no area for us to sit and watch or nothing. Like, this is it. Come and get your stuff and leave, basically, is what they told me. 
Hey y'all, so I've made it back home. I'm just leaving the, well not just leaving, but I just got home from the campus. I came home and took a shower because it is really hot outside. But, so when I went back up there at 12, 12.30, like I told you guys, and she texted me at the right time to come, they weren't even done setting up. They had just started setting up the building. And then on top of that, one of the ladies, I guess that's over it, that's running everything, she was like, well, did you watch the live on Amazon? And I was like, what you mean? I thought I came up here, you know, to watch it together because one of the ladies that's on group me, when she like shared the event, she said a watch party. Now, a watch party means we're going to one place and we're all watching it together. That's what I thought. The lady was like, oh no, you're supposed to watch it at home, screenshot it and come up here to pick up your lunch in your boss box. She understood the understood under, what is it called? She understood the... I don't know what it's called basically the girl gave me the wrong information but she went ahead and let me still participate so i'm gonna show you guys what they gave us as a um as like a freebie to take home with us so they did provide lunch i guess that's why i was at 12 opposed to 9 in the morning so originally the 9 a.m part was for you to watch it at home at 9 a.m because that's when the live started but they gave us a lunch from what is this called catering powered by Mets. I don't know. I got a turkey sandwich because I don't eat ham or red meat. I ain't even opened it yet. I was ready to come home and take a shower. So I'm going to open it now and see what they and see what they put in here. It's probably like your basic um, lunches that they give like businesses and stuff. Let's see. This is what it looks like. So you get a bag of Doritos. And then you get a turkey sandwich, a regular normal turkey sandwich. And then you get a, oh, this is new. I've never seen a pasta salad in boxes like this. This is new. I wonder what it smells like. Mind y'all, that whole time when I said I was gonna go back, go home and come back up there at 12, I didn't even go home. I went to Chick-fil-A at eight and went back up to the school and sat there for a good hour watching youtube videos <laughs> this thing is hard to open i can't really smell it but i mean i don't know it's not opening i mean it looked good and then you get a cookie and then fork for the pasta and your normal ketchup and mustard i mean what is that mayo and mustard I mean, this is like a, a regular club sandwich. I'll put this all back in here. So that's the lunch they gave out. And then for the box, the boss box thing, it's kind of big. This is what it is. I can't prepare in everything to a watch party. I brought my notebook. This is what I write like all my notes in and stuff for like my, uh, my business stuff is in here. Like just anything, I came to take notes. But like I said, this is the box. Let me open it. It's, uh, it's stuck in here. So you get this bookmark. And then you get, um, I wanna say this is like a journal. And like it comes with the cover, the hard cover that you can slide the book into. I don't know. Oh, also, this company was partnered with Capital One, so they came together and gave some stuff. And then you get a Capital One bag. It feel like there's something in here. Let's see if I can open it. I actually have an account with Capital One. I love Capital One. That was actually my first bank account that I ever opened, or well, that my mama opened. So you get a um a face mask like to put over your face while you sleep. I think it's just another um, bookmark. I don't know. You get some, oh, some mints. <laughs> they gave you some mints. And you also get, I don't know what this is, in a white box. These nails, I can't open nothing. This better not be a tape measure. What am I gonna do with it? Oh, it's like a car charger. And it turns into a wall plug charger. That's cute. I've never seen this before. And you can put the little two pieces at the bottom. So it's not just one cord, it's two. Wow, that's cute, creative. Look at me, talking trash, talking about a tape measure and it ain't even that. 
That's cute. Okay, next. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff in this box. And then you get a Capital One and I guess it's like an athletic company for people. A fitness class. And you get a month for free. Okay. And then you get, I noticed that Cream of Nature, the hair company, they were partnering with them also. So you also get some of their products and it looks like full size product. So this one is a hair mask, pure honey, rich coconut oil, creamy shea butter and yogurt. This is a hair mask, smell good. Mm, that's cute. And then you get these little packets of moisturizing shampoo and overnight treatment anti-breakage i don't know but you get these and then this i know for sure is a full bottle oh it's a leave-in conditioner i could use that oh i got these braids in oh wait no not leave-in conditioner okay i thought this is the moisturizer never mind can't use that and then it also came with do burst tin dry wet cloths i don't know what this is it won't even open. If y'all know what this is, let me know. Because I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. But thank y'all, I guess. And then you get some type of seasoning. Ooh. Cooking seasoning. I guess because everybody they partner with, they just threw it in the box. I'm going to have to try that. Then you get a, um, a bottle. A water bottle. And then, I guess you see this on your desk or whatever, but it's from Capital One. And then this is a poncho. I ran a poncho. And then you get a pen, I'm assuming this is. No, I don't think it's a pen. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I don't put that bad where it, where it came from. I don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know. It's another thing in here. I cannot pick it up for nothing. Let's see. Oh, it's a magnet. Put on the refrigerator or something. Tell y'all to shop on these people, Amazon stores. Shop the brands at Amazon Black Business Accelerator. So this is nice. It was cute. I actually did watch the summit on my own once the lady told me that I was supposed to watch it at home already. I was watching while they were setting up and they're supposed to be set up at 12.30. But yeah. They actually put a lot of stuff in this box. I mean, the box was pretty big. I kind of would be upset if this box was empty and it's this big. But it's, it's really cute though. It's bigger than my head. <laughs> So this probably will be the end of the vlog. Um, today is Saturday. I'm in for the rest of the day. I came home and took a shower. Y'all, it's so hot out there. But I do want to try to post this video tomorrow, which is Sunday. I want to have my weekly weekly vlogs posted Sunday and get them finished edited by Saturday night, which is tonight. Because for the rest of the day, I'm just going to do some more of my business stuff. I need to finish my business cards, my thank you cards my um i have to find jars for my products i have to find labels to put them on and i gotta start buying my ingredients so i'm about to re research some more stuff and try to get that all figured out i think i'm gonna show y'all how i made my business cards it's so cute hold on okay so for starters my business name is kalan to ray cosmetics now kalan means beautiful in greek I was trying to find a different word because at first my business name was um, K Tere Collection because I had tracksuits. I was going to do a custom clothing line, like I said earlier, but I changed it and I couldn't figure out what the K stood for until I just started looking stuff up on Google. But here's some, uh -oh. here's some of the logos that I made. I'm really trying to go with like a plain colors color scheme, so gray and white for me right now is looking bomb. So this is one. And then this is the other. It's basically the same, just a different font. This one is just thicker. But I did go with this one because I like how plain it is. But as far as my business cards, I was working on this earlier. This is what I want my front to look like. And I make all of my labels and business cards, like everything, using Canva. 
and I get ideas a lot of my ideas from Pinterest and Esty because honestly if I can do it on my own why would I pay somebody like I like these thank you cards right here I think I'm gonna recreate those or this one I don't know I like this one but it ain't I don't know I think I like this one much more better like, look at that that's so cute thanks babes you made our day that's cute I'm gonna do that we mean it really <laughs> yeah I think I'm gonna do this one I'm gonna recreate that put my own colors on it and put my own twist to it I'm not finna steal the people's stuff but I'm gonna put my own twist on it I mean it is only six dollars but with what I want on it I'd rather do it myself that way all I gotta pay for is them to be printed out so yeah so this is the front of it my favorite color is orange i try to incorporate some orange and i wanted to put this little plant here to like show that my plants are i'm not my plants my products are natural and then i don't know i just wanted that because uh oh it's on lock i wanted that there just to have something on the um card in a different color uh oh which i mean i can't say my design Oh, okay never mind but yeah I added that just to add some color uh oh my orange color went away I don't like that now I don't know I think it would better with the all white but I wanted to add a little bit of color to it because gray and white I mean it I did say I wanted it plain but I don't know but yeah that's gonna be the front and this is the back of the card I need to find a way to incorporate this quote right here. I already put that on there. I want to incorporate this quote. Erase that. I just don't know where to put it. I don't want to put it right there in that big. Like, that's tacky. Or if I should just put those on my thank you card. I don't know. I'm going to ask my mama. She know everything. <laughs> so this will be the end of my first official vlog. Because like I said, the rest of the day, I'm not doing anything that's worth picking up the camera and recording. But if I do, I will pick up the camera and, you know, add that in. But other than that, I don't have nothing else planned. Like I said, I'm going to edit this video and get this out by tomorrow. I'm not going to put a set time on it because you never just know how Wi-Fi works. But yes, thank you guys for watching and tune in to next week for the next vlog. Bye. Oh, wait. Maybe like this. I don't know, I'll figure it out. <laughs>